Similar concerns, there's a serious and very contagious dog flu spreading through the Charlotte area right now. Local veterinarian offices are getting busier every day, seeing an intense increase in the number of sick dogs. They're urging pet owners to keep an eye on their dogs and get them checked out if they're experiencing a bad cough. WCNC Charlotte's Chloe Leshner has more on the other challenges this outbreak is creating. Many dogs will be prescribed a medicine that you can fill at any pharmacy, but with respiratory virus season starting early for people too, pharmacies are slammed. Some saying they're having a hard time filling those prescriptions for pets. <laughs> a contagious cough sending dozens and dozens of dogs <laughs> to local veterinarian offices. Some respiratory virus that we have not seen before. Pet parents going to the pharmacy. But I have seen an uptick in the last maybe three weeks or four weeks of people with prescriptions for dogs. But some are struggling to get what they need. You okay, buddy? Vets say an outbreak of canine influenza has infected thousands of dogs in the area and left untreated, it can become dangerous. That's why many are given an antibiotic to prevent it from progressing to pneumonia. Amoxicillin, and of course amoxicillin is a general antibiotic given to adults, kids, pets. Um, and I've never in my 39 year career seen a really a shortage of amoxicillin to this degree. So suddenly this week, I can't get amoxicillin. I Meanwhile, several doggy daycare facilities are on high alert, enhancing cleaning procedures and some even temporarily shutting down. I called 30 different people and said, please don't board your dog here this weekend. I've got a whole other list of people to start calling today. Um, as a business owner, that is not something I want to do, but I can't in good conscience let you bring your dog to get sick. Symptoms can take three to seven days to appear, and dogs can spread it up to three weeks after they stop coughing. The best thing you can do is keep your dogs home. Um, don't put them out in social situations because this does seem to be very contagious. Just like for humans, there's a flu shot for dogs. Vets and boarding facilities recommending that you get that extra layer of protection for your dog this year. In Charlotte, Chloe Leshner, WCNC Charlotte.